Hello there guys, it's me Unstable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 9 of Civilization 6. I'm trying to get my first deity victory. I am going to have to go to war with Shaka. I think really it's the only chance I've got of, of winning this game. Uh, he's way out in the lead in tech. He's, he's 10 techs ahead of me. He's got armies. It's very scary. Um, I will declare war on him. There's three things that I need or want to do before I do so. The first of all is to get oil because I'd like to be able to upgrade my bombards into artillery. Now there is a source of oil all the way up here. Um, my original plan was to buy the oil and to be fair that kind of still is the plan. Uh, but I think it might be worth just settling a city up here just to get that oil. Uh, it'll be a really crappy city for sure. Um, but I think... Uh, actually having my own source of oil is 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 the best thing to do so we'll go ahead we've got the money we've got uh magnus here three turns still is established so we'll wait till he's in there we'll buy a settler we'll go ahead and grab that oil um the second thing that i want to do is make sure that we get ourselves uh if i click on the right tab that we get ourselves victor because i'll be wanting to sort of move him into the cities to deal with the unrest uh which obviously we'll get through unlocking some uh in fact we can we can actually grab him uh when we get civil engineering um now there's 10 turns for civil engineering to complete i might skip that because what i want to do uh well i, I will actually need civil engineering but um i need to get nationalism because that will allow, that's the one that allows me to uh create cores so we need nationalism, and then to create armies, I need to get to mobilization. So, it's a long way away. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave this for now, and just go into nationalism. We've got to go through enlightenment first, which is a pain. Uh, we could boost this by declaring war using a CB. I mean, I could just try and declare an early war against him, which, which I might do. Um, I'm a little bit worried about that army, but at the same time, I've got a feeling that it, that is his only, um, unit right there. Um, Sinbad did appear to have survived that somehow. Um, this government type gains a wild card slot policy. Oh, that'd be nice. What's my government type? Uh, it's one of these things. Uh, I am... Uh, Merchant Republic. Chances of it actually going through are slim to none, but yeah, it would be nice to have that. Let's put a few few votes in. Um, the chosen player generates 100% more grievances than other players, and other players generate 100% more grievances towards this player. Hmm, who could we have for that? Who doesn't like me? Well, Shaka doesn't like me. Let's do Congo, because he's pretty weak, and he's going to be irrelevant. Diplomatic victory. I'll choose myself, just to stop other people. And obviously, World's Fair. So we'll see how all of that goes through. Um, Classical Republic. Blah. Okay, Congo did go through. Great. Um, I got the diplomatic victory. Okay, so not too bad there. So, Simbad, you're going to destroy that. You've still got three charges left, but I, I want to bring you home. Or well, I guess we could go and destroy that. I was thinking leaving it there, because then it'll produce more ships, but... We might be better off just getting rid of it. Now, Cleo is busy down here. Um, but I think it would be nice if I can take him out. What is his military score still? Uh... Where are you? Yeah, you've still got really low strength, so I'm c going to continue to pump units out where I can. So, Is there anything useful that we, we would need in here? I mean, I guess I could get... A cavalry wouldn't about I be a bad idea. If I can take... If I can take a city down from range uh, with artillery then I can always jump in and try and grab it quickly with a cavalry. So that's not a bad idea. Uh, I can purchase with faith, which I keep doing, so... I am trying to um, 
you know, do some, some more conversions here. Can we buy in this city? No, we're going to have to do it in the capital. Um, so that's fine. So let's get ourselves... We can actually get uh, an apostle. Um... Which we probably want to do. So let's go for that. We're going to wait until we get that what before we uh, pop that missionary. And I am going to pop this one again because we are getting some uh, ideological pressure right there. That's fine. So we've got a field cannon. Yeah, it's going to be difficult um, because he's he really has placed these, this dis these districts in, in, in a good position. He's quite defensive there. Which is going to make life difficult for me. Um, let's try and just move you out. He's going to get a little bit upset that I've got so many units close by to him. Um, yeah, you can just stay there for now, I think. Let's see if I can buy oil. Does any... Actually, why don't I just use the mod that I've got to tell me if anybody has oil. Uh, you don't have oil... Uh, you, Dido does have oil. Uh, India does not. Shaka does not yet. Dido, can I buy your oil? I would very much like oil. Mm -hmm. 14 oh, for one oil. Mm -hmm. What if I take as much oil as you're willing to give me? How much are you willing to give me? 120 gold and 30 gold for 30 turns. That's a lot, but I'm going to take it because I want to get a head start on, on getting these units upgraded. If I'm going to declare a war on him, then I, I need them. Um, why? Oh, yeah, because I don't have the, the thing yet. Cause eight more turns. That's fine. So we, we at least need artillery. You want to buy my oil? No, I've just bought it for a reason. Now, I'm not bothered about breaking promises and things like that. So, if Shaka asks why I'm there, I'm just going to say I'm passing through. Oh, we've got a blizzard. I don't see that very often. My troops are passing by. I need artillery to make any kind of... Have a chance of doing anything against him. So, uh, there's the apostle. I, wanna, I want you to do is... Um, well, a couple of things. I want to launch the Inquisition, actually. Because we need to be able to go ahead and get rid of some of the other religions that are in our other cities. So you guys are just going to sit still for now. Are there any more ships down here? Doesn't look like there are. Let's just clear the camp out. That's a fair bit of money. We do need to bring Sinbad home now. Uh, can I get... So are you at war with him currently? And if not, why aren't you? No, you're not at war with him. Uh, but you do dislike him. So, can I ask you to declare a war on him? I can't at this point, unfortunately. Hmm. I should denounce Shaka, of course. I mean, there's no reason not to do that. Because then I can declare a war using a CB. Floods mitigated, but in comes the blizzard. That's not great, is it? Uh, yeah, so, Shaka, I'm going to go and uh, denounce him. That's fine. He's not going to like that, but I don't care. Uh, governor has been established. So, we're going to go over here now, and we're going to purchase a settler. And we're going to move that settler. In fact, I'm going to move the this guy up here just to make sure there are no barbarians. But we'll go up and get that oil for ourselves. Uh, you are going to continue trading there with Dido. And uh, yeah, there's oil down there, but I don't really want to try and get that. It's a bit bit silly trying to, to reach that. Uh, you do have two charges left, but you're very low on health. So it looks like Brussels is about to fall. I really want to try and get Cleopatra back at war with Congo, if I can. Not uh, not Congo, with um, Zulu. Uh, yeah, we failed. That's I kind of this, That was our spy failing in uh, the Zulu capital, which I kind of expected was going to happen. You know, I hoped it wouldn't, but I expected that it would. 
Um, a theatre square is probably not a bad idea. We can't get a very good one over here, though, so maybe we'll leave the theatre square here. Um, we've finished the what. Let's get... Let's get a commercial hub. I can actually get a plus five if I was willing to get rid of... I mean, that's a fair bit of food, but a plus five commercial hub is really useful for us. We'll grow in one turn. Uh, we can do the conversions now because we've got the uh, the thing that we wanted. So, yeah, our, our spy failed, which was a, a little unfortunate there. Um, can we afford an Inquisitor? Yes, we can. And, uh, yeah, we're going to start moving you up here. Hopefully with some backup so we can make sure that there's no uh, no barbarians up there. And then you are going to trade with... Um, yeah, let's get let's keep the science coming in where we can. They haven't taken Brussels yet. I do not know why. Brussels has got, like, no defences, no units, and their garrison health is on 20. They could have easily taken that. I don't know what is stopping them. If they don't take it on this turn, then there's a there's a serious problem. Uh, let's try and steal a tech boost again. Yeah, see, look at this. He's got he's got 80 army crews now. Uh, suzerain status lost. Brussels has been defeated. Okay, they finally did that. So if he's got the 80 army crew, yeah, his his army strength is getting higher now, but it's in like two units. That's where where it all is. Um. I might just need to just pump out units and try and yeah, because he's got he's got an anti tank crew over there. Nothing that I have can really do much damage to that. He's so far ahead of me in tech right now, but I need to do something. Um, right, let's get you let's get you over here so we can get rid of this religion. Go on, get moving. Um, yeah, cavalry. I don't have a good spot for you to stand in right now, so let's go ahead and move you over there. I mean, I could declare the war on him. Let's get that one going. So, yeah, we're going to continue out this way. I don't know what tile. I'm, I'm probably going to settle on this tile, so we start next to the oil, and we'll be able to grab the, the deer. As like I said, it's going to be a terrible city. It's not going to get any real growth worth speaking of. Um, at least we can still trade with Brussels there. If the borders grow now as well, we'll also be able to get another... Because I do have... No, I used it, didn't I? I can get another now and go down there and, and build something else up. Let's let's get home with, uh, with Sinbad. Try and uh, heal him up. That was somebody... Ah, Congo was trying to siphon money from me. How dare they? Uh, let's save the faith a little bit for now. Uh, what do we want over here? I think getting another bombard's probably not a terrible idea. Yep, you just keep moving over there. Governor title. Let's get Victor. And for the time being, I'll just put him in Braga so he's got somewhere to be. Uh, we'll pop you again. There we go. Voltology there. Start spreading our religion. Spreading it to ourselves, of course. But yeah, I'd really like to attack Congo before he gets a little bit too... Too big. Too big for his boots. Uh, Four-turn theatre square. Yeah, we can't get a very good one. Um, but let's just get one because we really need to be able to get this stuff here. Uh, yeah, let's get home with Simbad as much as possible. There's Broadway. That was a emergency finishing. Almost got you home. So we'll have enlightenment done at the end of this one. We should do at least. Scientific theory boost. There's steel done. There's enlightenment. I don't think we need to change anything there. Lots of uh, 
stuff. Pledge broken. That's fine. I don't care. Pledge to the Zulus. It's not a big, not a big deal as far as I'm concerned. Um, com combustion would be nice to get. Um, there again. I'm not sure if Oxford University is already gone. It's only three turns though, so let's have a look. Uh, so we'll get that. Lisbon, again, you might just want to just keep popping out units, really. Uh, you are going to try and remove the other religion from there. Didn't work very well. Um, yep, let's keep going that way. Right, can we upgrade any of these now to artillery? Yes, we can. Gives us some era score. There we go. We now have three artillery. The question is, what do we hit? Because this... We might want to hit that first and just get it out, out of the way. But that'll be on another turn. Uh, Simbad. Can't quite get you home on this turn. Get you home on the next one. Hopefully we'll get a couple more uses out of him. Yeah, I've got to do something with you because I've now got two units sat on the same tile. There we go. So let's get some units forward. Move you to there. Yeah, we're going to have to get this war started soon. Oh, this is a new one. The international trade routes from this city receive two gold for every luxury resource at the destination. That might even be worth uh, getting. Doesn't have a lot of good tiles for it. Must be built on a coast tile that is adjacent to a harbour district. I guess there's my harbour. So, yeah, it's one or the other. So, uh, I, unfortunately, it would mean getting rid of the crabs. Ah. Here's a thought. Does that tile count? Because that's next to a harbour and it's coastal. Yes, it does. Excellent. So, we'll see if we can get that. Um, yep, you're going to keep trying to get rid of that other religion. What is in there? Doesn't look like there's anything else in there. It's just we're losing it to pressure now. That's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll move on. So all of these guys keep still for now. Uh, we'll declare our war on the next turn. Hopefully we can just take these things out quickly. Let's get over there. This is the tile that I want to settle on right there. Um, yep, you rest and repair. Probably won't find an awful lot else that we can do with Simbad. We'll have a little look around, see if we can find any more barbarian camps over to the east. Might work out for us. Um, yeah, all of our other cities look good. Let's get you over to here, and we'll, we'll see if we can flip Antanan and Evo. Um... Obviously, we don't want to trade with Shaka. We are about to declare a war on him. Um, yeah, the question is, when do we do it? Do we go for it? I think I'll just wait a little bit. How long? Declare war using a CB. How long do I have before I can declare that CB war? Declare formal war. Yeah, so we can do a formal war. And that will give me a boost on that. But obviously I'm going to have to go to war before I can do it. I'll wait one more turn just to get scientific theory finished. And then we might just need to buy a lot of units. I'm going to have to use my money to help here. I don't know what your problem is, Cleo. What's, what, what's wrong? What you got going on? Who's upset you? 
There's an eruption, but I think, yep, that's the city with Liang. Change the facts. So that's not too much of a problem for us. So you're going to carry on with that. Now, some of these things would be useful, but I think we go military science. Getting tanks might give us a bit of an edge. Um, so could we get... Uh, yeah, it looks like it's already gone. So we can't get Oxford University. I assume it is. It's normally a very popular one that does, does go quickly. Uh, battleships. If we had coal, which we do not, we could get battleships. Um, let's just keep some field cannons going because I've got a feel feeling we might lose a few. Uh, let's try and... No, our spy got captured. That was unfortunate. Um, there's another field cannon. Kind of running out of places for units to stand right now. So I really would like to be able... I don't want to move that artillery any further forward. I really would like to be able to um, start forming armies and corps and things. I think that would help. Uh, you are going to um, settle there. It's a terrible city. I know it is. Um, we're going to start building the monument, but we're also going to buy the granary, and we are going to buy a builder, and then the builder can go and get that oil. Okay, let's see. Is there anything else that we need to do here? You can probably stay there for now. Didn't mean to hit next turn, but I did. So yeah, we'll see if we can get... We need to get another spy now as well. But yeah, I think when we come back on the next video, we will be declaring our war with Zulu. So thanks a lot for watching. Hope you are still enjoying Civilization 6. If you are, please do consider leaving a like on the video. And I will see you next time. Until then, goodbye for now.